The mayor and the chief say the council's cuts will undo years of work to recruit diverse officers. The council says that can be avoided. The Seattle Police Department says these officers, some of its newer, more diverse people, are most at risk of being laid off if the city council approves a plan to slash SPD jobs. The whole reason why I got into this job is because I wanted to make a change and be, you know, that bridge, um, that open line of communication for my community who's, you know, been pretty underserved. We definitely do care and we, you know, we want to see justice um, just as everyone else does. Their stories are featured on a new SPD website meant to put a human face on the department and explain how officers do their jobs and the rules they must follow when using force. The cries of frustration that we're seeing across the nation, yes, is real. Uh, but on the same token, people got to know that we're also reaching out, trying to do everything that we can, everything we can in this department to rectify some of the issues that we've been facing. City council members who plan to trim as many as 100 SPD jobs disagree with the mayor and police chief's interpretation of city law, which requires SPD to cut the newest hires first. The mayor paints a picture that the council is interested in eliminating diverse recruits and that those would be the first to go. But the mayor's assertion that there is no way to avoid laying off diverse recruits is simply untrue. They say the mayor can make a request to a city commission that deals with officer hiring and firing and ask if SPD can go out of order with layoffs to hold on to those younger officers. Chief Carmen Best disagrees. And I don't think um, that that's allowable. Officers we spoke with today also talked about morale in the police department. One of them saying in his 17 years, he's never seen it so low. In Seattle, Ted Land, King 5 News.